and welcome back to another video. Today I'll be looking at uh, Weapons Evolved add-on. Now, this did interest me. It is a little bit expensive, but it did interest me because, um... I talked about this during the, the Tinker Construct add-on review, but... In Tinker's Construct on the Jar Edition, one of my favourite features was that, um... You could replace the parts on your tools and weapons and that, uh... uh they, you did, I get EX... They get... To like levels and they'd level up and they could add like more um abilities onto it uh, with like items like slime balls and the silky gem and the, the lapis for looting and stuff like that and um this kind of is the same vein in that way your weapons level up so i thought yeah might as well look into this because we, we actually got like a pretty good update like I did like multiple add-ons there, I thought that was like really good. And one of them's like really cheap, you'll see, uh, uh, I'll talk about that in the add-on, but, because uh, I can't remember the name off the top of my head, but. A lot of cool looking add-ons. Oh, everything's broken. <laughs> Everything is broken. Yeah. I'm starting to think that, um, this world is reaching the limit for the amount of add-ons that can be put on it at one time before it just breaks down and just... Like, what? Oh, ev everything. Like, even chest! Why are chest broken? I don't even have a texture pack that's affecting it. Oh! That's broke. The sun's broke and it's big. Sun big. Um, mimics aren't broke. None of this is any more broken than it was before. Um, I think pistons are also broke. Yeah, the piston. No, just the piston heads are broke. Oh. Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to start a new world. Because, uh, everything's a little bit broken here. So, yeah, I'm gonna be back in a m in a minute, in a new world. And hopefully everything's not gonna be broken, if everything's still broken then. It's not good. Well, obviously it's not good, but... It's even like an odd, like... And all the add-on stuff is broken. Banners are broken. It's mostly vanilla stuff. Well, yeah, it's pretty much just vanilla stuff that's broken. Why did he break all the vanilla things? I broke my mat floor. It broke my chest. Little textures on them. I what? And it broke the pause screen and ever. Oh, oh, your game not happy. Game crashed. Uh, I'll be back in a minute. Okay, I'm back. And uh, I removed a few add-ons. So now it's not broken. I'm going to say it should be fine. Um, yeah. Let's get started with this then, shall we? And the book's not working. Okay, the book's not working. Oh, this is not off to good start. And this was one of the more expensive ones that uh, was released. You should... Uh, you would expect the book at least to be working. So I'll be back in another minute, see if I can get the book working. 
Okay, so I figured out what was going on. Um, I have a, a 3D item texture pack that I like to use because it's cool and it's, you know, it makes some items 3D, vanilla items 3D. And one of those items is the book. And I think because that changes the book texture, it was conflicting with the textures for this, which made this not appear. So they clearly didn't test this with any sort of texture pack because I'm pretty sure every texture pack would have changed the book texture causing that same glitch for them. So yeah, not off to a good start. Like, I can excuse the whole like, will everything break, or like the vanilla stuff breaking because I just had too many add-ons. That's not this add-on's fault. That's just a limitation of Minecraft, but this, but this not working because I had a texture pack and I just changed the book, how books look. That is on there because I'm pretty sure this probably, they probably, you probably have this uh, problem with that. Any texture pack that changes how books look and yeah they probably should have been able to catch that but now we've got it working so let's get into this so more weapons add-on dive into immersive gaming adventure with 10 diverse weapon types each featuring unique gameplay features upgrade each weapon to up to five times discover ex Exclusive craft crafting recipes for individual weapons and the forge your uh, arsenal from a selection of 10 materials including familiar ones like wood, stone, iron, gold, diamond, netherite and the, the new materials like copper, emerald, amethyst and obsidian. How to upgrade. Upgrade your weapons by placing uh, two of the same uh, material and level into the crafting table along uh, with an upgrade star of the uh, same material, uh, repeat up to five times for each uh, weapon uh, for each uh, weapon, uh, eat, enhance your arsenal for increased strength so you make a star with five of them, you make uh, and they've changed like the sword and then you get, ah, so then you get two swords and the upgrade star okay, so Let's do this with like, an, I've got a bunch of iron, so and let's get a couple of sticks. Probably not going to need this much iron. So do they appear here? Yes, they do. So we make one of them. That's not the right sword, is that? Yeah, there we go. So we make two of them. And then we can upgrade this. So they're just iron sword, regular iron sword. So then we get iron sword level one, which does, which is basically a diamond sword. So we can do this up to five times. So that's one. So let's make four more of these, and then I can put the. Uh, oh wait, now I'm gonna need a bunch of these because it's gonna. So I'm going to need two level ones. Hold on. I'm just going to craft a bunch of them. And get some more iron because... This is going to be extremely expensive. And I'm going to need a lot of sticks as well. So then... We make two more iron swords. Then we upgrade them to iron sword level one. Then we upgrade that to iron sword level two, which does eight attack damage. And then we need, oh god, this is so expensive. So we're gonna need uh, four of these. And we upgrade them to level one, then to level two, and then to level three, which does nine attack damage. These do look cool as you get higher up, though. And now, so, oh, I'm having to do the math in my head here. So, a level three, so we want two ones. 
So we want two threes, which is two twos, which is two ones. So that's. So we want one more three. So that's two. Two twos and the four ones. Which means I need two more, which means I need more regular swords because that's four and that's going to make two, so I need four more. So that's one, two, three, four ones, two twos, and then that's a second three. So now we can upgrade to level four, which does 10 attack damage. Oh, you are going to need, yeah, this is extremely expensive. I'm already uh, probably going to need a bit more iron. So, to make, to make a four, another four to max this out, we're going to need... Oh yeah, hold on. I want a sword. So, yeah, five is the max. So to make a five, we need two fours, and I've already got one four. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, eight iron swords. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight iron swords. One, two, three, four level ones. Two level twos, and that's a level three. There's one level three, and I need uh, eight more. Six, seven, eight. Iron sword, iron sword. Oh, and I'm out of the uh, star things. That, oh, right now, I'm gonna need a bunch more. That's one, two, three, four level ones, two level twos, a level three, and that's a level four, and that's an iron sword level five that does 11 attack damage. Oh, it does look cool though. Now, I'm going to go into creative mode and see if these can be enchanted. You get the enchanted book that has every enchantment in the game almost. Sword book. So, yep, yeah, they can be enchanted. So it now does 17 attack damage with sharpness 5, looting 3, unbreaking sharpness, mending, and knockback. Yep. Oh, I forgot I'm still in creative. And I reckon you can do this with like every sword. And there's all the Tinker Construct swords. Well, every Tinker Construct sword with the word iron. So, anyway. So I'm just gonna. Alright, so it doesn't really. So... Yeah, it doesn't have anything that. So. Can I. I don't know! Right. So I don't know how I'm gonna go about finding out like all of the different. Oh wait, yeah. 
I forgot there's more to the book. Yes, yeah, so you got like swords. Yeah, and gameplay, blah blah blah. And then you got axes, where they do a bit more damage. Now that. Yeah, and then you got double bladed axe. Yeah, these look cool. So this shows you how, like, what they all look like. Then you've got hammers. Uh, am I dry, strong and knock back launches enemies into the air? You got a flail. Flail can be uh, swung by holding the interact button, dealing damage in a small. Oh, let's have a look at that. So it's three sticks, a uh, string under the. So. Yeah, let's get a diamond. And let's get a string. Oh, yeah, I'm in creative still. Yeah. Is it and I'm just gonna craft it manually. See if I can click properly, that is. That's what the book. Yeah, three sticks. Why won't it let me craft it? String diamond. String diamond. Stick, stick, stick. Why are you know it? Hold on, let me put all the iron stuff in here as well. Real quick. So, spear, dagger, walking stick, flail. Uh, so yeah, amethyst, copper, diamond. Cobweb! Yeah, someone does that, so... That, yeah, this game, not the best quality control, so they've not tested it with texture packs, and they've not actually tested it to see if you can actually uh, see if it's the right thing. So I need a cobweb and not a piece of string, because probably they've meant to put string, but some dumb dumb put cobweb instead. Give that P cob. Where? Am I missing something? C O B W E B. Give at P C O B W E. Yeah, hold on. Gonna go into game mode one. And I'll be able to get a cobweb from here. Stack of cobwebs. And now I can make a flail. So it does seven attack damage, just like a diamond sword. Uh, let's summon a cow. Okay. No. 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 Not really. No. Also, why is it doing so little damage? Like that cat. That cows don't have that much health. Why do it take so long to kill it? It's a bit disappointing because it's just like this tiny little thing that's spinning around. Doesn't really feel like a proper like flail. No, 
It does so little damage. But it doesn't matter if I'm like, holding it down or what. I mean, I guess, um... Oh, he does do that in quick succession. It's just like, yeah. That's kind of, that's, that's really just like disappointing. Hold on, let's, uh, go into game mode one real quick. And let's see. Flail. Flail. Diamond Flail 5. Okay, this one looks a bit better. No. Oh, I accidentally attacked the computer chair. No. 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 It looks better, but it just still feels like it takes a while to kill. It also does do AoE, so I guess that's kind of alright, but... Eh, bit underwhelming. Uh, actually, I probably need those sticks. Now, let's take a look at the hammer as well. Might as well take a look at all of them, so it's just like six. I'm just gonna go into game mode one and get boat get like this. Diamond hammer. The eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and thirteen. Unenchanted. Yeah, they do look cool. Let's go game mode zero real quick. Summon the cow. Woo. Yeah, that killed it real quick. Yeah, nine damage. Uh, let's summon something a bit more beefy than the cow. Uh, pill. Pillager. Right, come here. Let's just say he did 49 damage. 46 damage. Damn. Hold on. Uh, yeah, let's go to the end. And test this out on the Ender Dragon. Uh, I'm just gonna... Well, actually... I'll do it, but that'll make a sound. And this is unenchanted. Probably enchanted and do even more damage. Um, I'm just gonna get... Go over here... Back here. Yeah, actually, yeah, back here would be fine. Set block and tab 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 and portal. I wonder what they damaged me. Oh wait, is the Ender Dragon alive? Yeah, oh, there's, there must have done a bit of damage to it at some point and forgot. One shot set and so I a bit new. I killed the Ender Dragon. You didn't even, didn't even see the health bar go down, it's like dead. Hold on. Let's test this out on the wither.
And for the amount of like diamonds you have, you'd have to like get to craft this, it should probably be quite powerful. Yeah, with the like flail mace, whatever. It kind of feels just like you're slapping them with a wet fish. Alright, when you're at, when you're not like slapping them with a wet fish, you're like hitting them in the face with a giant ball made of diamonds. Shouldn't feel like you're slapping them in the face with a wet fish. And uh, let's just. Yeah, I'm just gonna go to the end of here. Actually, no, I probably don't even need to, need to go that far. I'm just probably just gonna like two shot it or something. And I don't really care about this game destroyed because it's just not going to review. The copy of the world I use to review add ons. Um, someone with. With a just wait for him to blow up. Oh, get down here, you come on. Okay, maybe hiding him down here wasn't the best idea I ever had. Yep. Oh, well, I'm gonna eat it. Come on, get down. Yeah. Come on, get ya. Yeah. I don't know where you took them from. There. Come on, get down here so I can hit ya. I might have to just get into creative because he's just flying up there. Hold on. Alright, come here. Okay, not one shot in there. Doing a fair bit of damage. And he's dead. See, quite strong. And now I can't find my hole. There it is. Again, this is unenchanted. You can like enchant with sharpness. Like, how much damage would it do enchanted with sharpness? Seriously, that would just be just extremely up. OP. So let me... Hold on. Bonk. Let me go down here. Yeah, and get another enchanted book. And my inventory is full of rubbish because of the weather. And I can go in there. Let's see. So, currently doing 13 when chance with sharpness 5, it does 19 attack damage. That's seen, well, yeah, that's just 
Summon an Enderman. I was already wanting a shiny enough to one shine Enderman. That yes, 52 damage per hit. Let's see what's next. Got a sickle, uh, a uh, battle sickle with a carved blade down the dust, sturdy handle for quicker and the diverse versatile strikes. The sickle deals uh, damage with a uh, high knockback around you in an inter on the interaction with five second cooldown. So S I sickle. So we have all the different levels of sickle, 7, 8, 9, 8, 10, 12. So let's take a look at the final one real quick because I'm not going to go through all of them again. All of them all the time. So, game mode 0. Someone on the pill. So if I right click, it does that. Oh, it also killed some of my decorations. All my decorations up. Uh, I hate it that it automatically puts that into your offhand. Oh, and I also killed that balloon. I've got an itchy eye. Right. So I can get a couple of these guys in. Because I think. So this does AOE. Oh. Yeah. It's a really big AoE as well. And it does decent damage. Oh, is it just down as big of a hit is enough to take out them. So this is actually pretty strong as well. I mean, it's not as strong as like the hammer, just like hitting a single enemy, but if you're being attacked by multiple enemies, this is, I'd argue this is probably better because you can just do a bunch of damage to a bunch of enemies at the same time. And obviously they can all probably also be enchanted just like the hammers. Right, key mode one again. Next up we have the dagger. Uh yeah, this is probably gonna have really low attack damage. One, two, three, dag. There you go, all the diamond daggers that so you can see here. We're just gonna skip to the last one. Does ten attack damage. Let's just summon the pillager. Oh, 38 attack damage. Uh, steel dagger. Uh, the dagger affects a... Affects a wither effect to the enemy with each attack. Well, the... Doesn't really matter when you just shot one of them. Well, they've got new bows. Not really seen any new bows in any of the other add-ons. So we've got bows. So if I go to game mode 1E. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I've not seen any new bows in the add-on. Bow. And these are missing their textures. Great. Yeah, I was right, there's no other bow. There's teddy bear anywhere from there, fruit bowl, crossbow, or whatever. Hammer, rainbow, and balloons. So let's get a diamond bow. So you can't see them. And they stack up to 64. Oh, but you can see them in your hand. Yeah, this this really needed to go through more QA. I need, probably need some ammos. 
even in creative. No, nope. I don't think this works. Properly. Now, before I just right, so uh, when I did the um, Tinker's Construct review, I just assumed that it was buggy and broken, but for some reason. It just didn't work properly on this world, so this might be the same thing with this. So I'll be back in a minute in a uh, completely different world, and we'll see if it's just broken or if it's just this world that it's not working on for some reason, just like Tinker's Construct. Right, so I'm creating an entirely new world. And this is the only add-on in it, so if it's not working in here, then it just doesn't work. Spawned in the jungle. Oh, there's a there's an issue in there. Bit far away from spawn for the template that I'm going to use. The template, I thought it was going to spawn me on the mushroom biome. Anyway, but... Okay, yeah, so it's just my world for some reason it doesn't like to, doesn't want to work on. Let's do Diamond Bow. So we can actually see what, like, so, five, so we've got Amethyst, we've got Copper, we've got Diamond, Emerald, Gold, Iron, Neverite, Obsidian, and Stone, and Wood. So yeah, and yeah, so it's like five for amethyst, four for copper, diamond is six, emerald six, gold three, iron five. So it seems like iron is better than the copper, but the same as amethyst, and gold is worse than copper, and then stone, so three and four, so Woods as good as gold and stones as good as amethyst. Uh, wait now, stone is four, so it's as good as copper, but not amethyst. And then you got diamond, emerald, and diamond, which are both six. And then you got uh, then you got neverite and obsidian that are levels that are seven. And I'll probably like translate over to all the different weapons. Uh, let me just get a in fin. Let's see, can can we enchant this for infinity? And an anvil, and an anvil, and I still need a single arrow. At least. Yeah, can enchant it with infinity. It's doing three damage. Hmm, that's odd. There's not any new arrows out there, there's um, pro tips, arrows, no, nope, no new arrows. Why is it suddenly doing free damage? Hold on, what if I get power, power five? It's doing seven damage, eight, eight, six damage, eight damage, eight damage. Yeah, this is a bit rubbish. Like with a regular bow, fully enchanted with power five, you can do like 20 damage, I think. Seems a bit odd that these can't, that a diamond one can't even like, get up to a regular bow. I think the the problem might be that these are supposed to be critical hits and they're not critical hitting. So they're supposed to be like something like double the amount of damage. Because they're doing like 8 and 7, they're supposed to be like doing 16 and uh, 14. Ah. 
or something like that. Yeah, but it's pretty much under, pretty underwhelming. Like this is like the max level bow. You would have to craft like a bunch of diamond bows just to get this bow, and it's really not that good. Like, would just a regular diamond bow do like one damage? Four, three. Didn't see that one. Four. Yeah, so for all that effort, you're only really getting like two extra damage. Yeah, just craft the base like diamond bear and you sh and just like enchant that with power five. Or bear yet. Like yeah, look, power five. Let's get a regular bow. I'm not gonna be able to see the damage with and like a regular bow with power five. This is doing nine damage. This is doing seven six. So that's doing like up to like I've seen this do like up to eight damage. So it's doing less damage than the regular diamond bow. And the regular bow just one shots. So yeah, oh that did twenty-four damage according to this. So this has its own damage indicator. Yeah, this is doing twenty-four damage. 23 damage. Why would I craft any other bow than this bow if it's not going to do more than more damage than this bow? With the same amount of investment. Yeah, so the bows just are not worth it at all. So, yeah, bows are a complete scam. Okay, next up we have the trident, which, yeah, these look cool. Uh, trident uh, features built-in uh, riptide, the function only when uh, swimming in water. Ah, cool. So let's get a trident. So you can see the trident here, I should probably should just, just put it in there. Uh, diamond trident. So let's summon in a pillager. Oh, I can't see how much damage I did. Hold on. 43 damage. Uh, can this be enchanted? Yeah, it can be enchanted with looting, unbreaking, sharpness 5. Mending it and not back. So now it's doing 49 damage. I said it had built in Riptide. So let's test it out. Where rain. Oh, no, so the Riptide doesn't work in rain. And you have to go pick it up, pick it, pick it up, so it doesn't, so yeah, that doesn't. Oh, and it doesn't do nearly as much damage, because I can just one-shot punch in. Uh, let's clear the weather. So apparently Riptide's not working in rain, unlike a vanilla. So let's just go and go and find some water and see if it works in, make sure it works in water because I don't want to just assume that it just doesn't work in rain and then for it to also not work in water. Yeah, it does work in water. What? It worked once and now it's not working. I don't remember 
removed all the... What? Okay, so this is a bit buggy. Well. That's not good. What in the heck? Oh. They're broke. So yeah, Trident. Uh, it's cool for damage, but if you want Riptide, just go with a regular Riptide Trident. I wouldn't really recommend this as a ranged weapon. So, yeah. Uh, don't use Riptide on that because it's going to erase all your enchantments. Uh, this. And we have Spear. Spear grants a permanent speed buff level 1 while holding it. So, yeah, let's get a. Spear. Diamond Spear level 5. Yeah, it got speed. And attack damage. Does 58 down yet? Yeah. yeah, you get the idea. It's basically just a dabby thing, but just a bunch of damage. Then we got the bow. Yo. The bow staff delivers at a high knockback, tossing enemies away with each strike. The bow. And I get everything with the, those two letters in it. And it's bugged. Uh, let's just look at the axes real quick. A, X, E. And the axe. Oh, I know that's, uh, I think it's construct. And they're also bugged. So uh, let's go check out those last two, uh, the bow, staff, and the axes in the other world real quick.